today I'm going to show you guys five mods from mind test that you probably either forgot existed or maybe just never even heard of. Most of these mods have been buried deep in the mind test forums and only have a few downloads. Make sure to watch the end because one of the last mods I'm going to show you guys, I'm really glad I rediscovered it because it's a really great mod for survival. Anyways, before we get into the video, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already if you want to discover more cool mods like the ones I'm about to show you. Anyways, let's get right into it. Number one. The first mod we're looking at today is the Connected Textures mod. This mod is going to make blocks like grass, snow, and rainforest litter have the same side texture as their top texture, which is going to make slopes look very smoothed out. I really like how nice it looks, and I think it's especially going to look nice with the new lighting effects that are coming out in March for Mind Test. So I think a lot of people are going to really like the look of this, so make sure to check this out. It's going to make slopes look way nicer. Number two. Now we're going to look at the Creatures Mobs Engine mod, aka CME. This was the very first mobs mod I ever used on Mind Test. And it's going to add zombies, Orokis, ghosts, and also chickens and sheep. And I think a lot of people are really going to like this mod because it only adds a few mobs. So if you're looking for just a few mobs and not filling your entire world with all types of monsters and animals, I think you're really going to enjoy this mod. And to this day, I think it has the best visuals and sounds of all the mobs mods. So definitely make sure to check out CME. Number three. The next mod we're going to look at is the April Fools mod. This is a pretty fun mod to secretly put on your multiplayer world. Now every once in a while players all over the server will get pranked. Whether this be a craft not working, a tool swapping, a message telling you you just got fly privileges, or you just randomly teleporting one block to the side. This is going to be a really fun mod, just make sure to tell nobody you put it on your world. People are going to have no idea what hit them. Number four. Now this next mod I'm going to show you guys is probably one of the most ridiculous mods you've ever seen in Mind Test. But in a second, we'll get on to our fifth mod, and I'm going to show you guys a more serious mod that you're going to want to put on every one of your survival worlds. But for now, bear with me, this mod is pretty funny. And this is the Lucky Ore mod. This mod adds a new ore to the world called Lucky Ore that spawns like as much as coal, I think actually probably even more. When you break this block, it's going to show this animation of all the blocks in the game and it will drop out a random item from the game. And every once in a while, these blocks just explode. This can get pretty crazy, especially because it has a really loud sound. And let me just give you a tip, don't break a million of these blocks at once or you're going to get a headache from the sound because it gets so loud. But anyways, this mod's pretty fun, and if you want to just create a world to mess around and goof off, this is the mod for you. So, make sure to check out this mod, its link will be in the description below. And finally, number 5. The last mod I'm going to show you guys is the campfire mod. This mod is going to add two new items to the game, including a sleeping bag and a nice little campfire. I really like this mod, it's going to let you go around and camp out and sleep under the stars at night. While I'm not sure if the campfire can really cook, it didn't seem to be working for me when I tried it, maybe it's just a problem on my end, it's still a really nice visual, and it's going to make you feel like you're settling down after a long day of exploring. So make sure to check out this mod and put it on your survival worlds today. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this video showed you guys some mods that you forgot about or maybe just showed you some new ones. If you enjoyed learning about these mods, make sure to watch this video also because it's going to show you a variety of new mods that you probably have never even heard of. Anyways, God bless you guys and have a great day.